Hey everybody, welcome back to the Goat Force Gaming Channel where, uh, you know, we're just Ball here 24-7, well maybe not 24-7, but we're playing the roguelikes and the roguelites and uh, uh, we're trying to spread how awesome they are, holy moly, seven areas in this chapter, hey I'm, I'm up for it. We're trying to spread how good these games are. Um, games like Anvil, Vault Breakers, um, the, uh, you know, if, if uh, Smash TV was a roguelite, that game. Um, <laughs> so, welcome back to this one. Um, you know, we had a heck of a run last time around. Um, it was quite enjoyable where uh, we were able to take down the boss of uh, the first planet. And um, I'm trying to think, you know, when I was playing the uh, demo version previously uh, that, that the devs allowed me access to, um, I think I did make it this far. Let's see, let's go with the additional mines this time. Maybe we'll uh, buff in that direction. Um, but I don't think I played it a whole bunch. It was just, you know, once or twice. And um, I think I remember it being pretty tough. I know, big surprise. But, you know, we've we've done uh, we've done kind of you know defensive, big beefy boy durability builds, and we've we've also now gone in the direction of uh, more offensive uh, capabilities as far as the upgrades. And it seems like offense is the way to go. Um, so I think I think we're going to do that again today. I have heard that uh, this area is a little bit more open-ended as far as uh, you know where you're going to go and the direction you're going to take. So let's um, let's maybe go with let's go with this cooldown. I like the greaves because you can get your dash back a little bit faster, get the capabilities back as well. Which those are extremely important, especially if we're going to buff the hell out of the mines, which I wouldn't mind doing. All right, so the goat is already lost. Imagine that. Did I just take a wrong turn at Albuquerque here? Hmm. What did I do wrong? Or have I done? Oh, here we go. Got it. Okay. That's going to happen. It's going to happen. You know, when I first started playing, I didn't realize that uh, we got that nifty little arrow thingy that points you around. And, uh, you know, of course, once I realized that was a thing, it became a lot easier getting around. Okay. Let's uh, maybe stay out of the way of that. Alright. Oh, I like I like a good time to dodge, as you all know. Alright. The heartbeat always makes me think that I'm low on health, but that's not the case this time. Speaking of health, we've got a drop, and uh, we've got maybe a good-looking gun here. That uh, plumber shotgun that I had in the last run. Uh, it, it really was awesome. Ah, the sniper rifle. I don't love it. It's just a little too slow. Okay, we'll go with this. And let's see what we got in here. Skill cooldown reduced by 0.5 second. For each second after weapon is not in use for three seconds. I don't know. Immunity against shock. Ignore 20% of enemies' defense. Let's do that. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, so it does seem like it's a little bit more open-ended because uh, I'm not seeing that arrow, you know, kind of telling us where to go next, which is, you know, I don't mind that at all. Kind of cool, actually. If 
this is your first time setting eyes on this game, um, it, uh, it's awesome. I've been having a blast with it. But I should say, too, that uh, it's on Game Pass, and it's also uh, out in, uh, I believe, early access form out on Steam. Um, but I recommend it. You know, I think the devs are making good changes to it. It, it plays really well. It's got some jank here and there, but, you know, all games do. Okay. But I, you know, I think they're working to uh, solve said jank. If you like beefy boss battles that uh, go on for, you know, quite some time, you're absolutely going to find that here. Now what I'm trying to find is a moment, just a moment to take a sip of coffee. I've been, uh, as I've mentioned in the past, I've been burning through a coffee advent calendar that my wife picked up for me. And uh, today, I've got an excellent cup called uh, Heavenly Hazelnut. And I'll tell you what, it's quite heavenly. So cheers to you if you happen to be drinking a coffee or a tea or, oh, you know, whatever liquid of, of your choice is. Cheers to you. Thanks for being here on the channel. And if you enjoy uh, roguelikes and roguelites, um, you're in the right place. I mean, I play them all. It's my favorite type of game. Join us. Join the community. Okay, so I wonder if there's a way pull that map out a little bit more. Let me see here. Maybe M? Nope. Maybe tab? No. Okay. Well, that's all right. I bet there is a way to pull that map out, though. I'll look into it. In the meantime, we'll keep rocking and rolling here. Enemies are growing Oh, indeed they are. Indeed, that's kind of what they do, especially when we get attacked like this. Oh, they've left down some, uh, some traps for us this time. Ooh, wow. Okay. Speaking of traps, let's throw down some uh, mines. I like that the jungler now has three uses of mines that... Uh, charge back up over time. When the game, uh, you know, was first out in alpha form, uh, the jungler only had one use of the mines. So it's nice to have multiple recharges happening. Right, come on, guy. Ooh, what do we got here? A freezer rifle. Okay, we're gonna take that. In fact, pretty sure that's what we're getting shot at with right now. Ooh, that's nice. Outstanding. Oh, you love to see it. I love a good debuff in, in games, just in general. Lancer rifle. Uh, I I think we're I think we're good with the freezer rifle. Okay, so we've got four hundred and eighty-three dollars. Let's, uh, let's grab an upgrade or two over here, depending on what they are offering. Let's see, fifty percent increase, thirty percent skill power. Hmm. Okay, so the middle one that's that's going to die out at some point after acquiring a relic. Fifty percent increase to defense until a hundred kills. Twenty-five percent increase. Oh. Oh, that's nice. Let's do that. Oh, are we getting hit? We are. We are. Okay. Okay. Now, do we want to get the skill power? I think we do. All right. Good deal. Got some upgrades over here as well. definitely a longer opening area, I'll say. 
Okay, 20%. Well, we just saw that. Increase max rounds by 20. Oh, I wouldn't mind that. 100% weapon damage increase. Walk speed reduced to zero. Mm, no. We'll do the max rounds. That'll be nice. Avoid a reload in the middle of battle every once in a while. I don't hate it. All right, so I think we have maximized that. Let's head over here. Okay. Well, we've got one of these guys again. Enjoy waking up and stepping right on that. How about it? Boy, this freezer rifle is fantastic. Loving that. Wow. He's dead. That's great. Okay. Um, let's get these freebies and maybe... Oh, there we go. Look at that. They're trying to end the level for me, but we got plenty of guys left. These guys aren't ready for me to leave. Okay, I'm not ready either. I, I want I want one more set of upgrades here. We got 200. Uh, let's see, immunity against poison. Receive additional attack power equal to defense. Wow, that sounds really good. One chance to recover 3% of max HP when attacking. You know, we're gonna go with the heal scope. That sounds, that sounds decent. All right. I like that uh, attack power equal to defense thing. Starting planet exploration. Now this appears to be maybe a boss fight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it's a boss fight. Let's see what happens here. Let's grab our free suit upgrade. Uh, let's go with that. We'll just keep upgrading in the direction of the mines for now, and that'll. That'll do it. Um, we got full health. Let's see what we got here. With the Overseer, a flash across the battlefield. All right. Looks, looks pretty wild. We got these guys already, too. Okay. All right. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, so those guys are taken out. Oh, this guy's got a movement speed increase as well for another one second. All right, all right, all right, all right. Wow. Okay. This guy's not playing around, right? Couldn't see him for a second there. Oh, man. Okay, so when he falls down, he's going to fire that big beam. Keep that in mind. Those are his random shots when those turn red. Okay, now he's got the big blast. All right. Shots. All right, big blast. Okay. I think he's manageable, but you know what? We need to get some health back. That's ooh, got all of that one. Oh, 
Yeah, we'll just load it up. And have him walk in this direction for us. There we go. Ooh, there it is. There it is. Okay, if we can get him down to the yellow bar, uh, that'll be his last health bar. I think. We're about to find out. Okay, all right. Going okay. I like them apples. Okay. We're working on his last... Oh, dang. Okay, so he's got like a... He's got new stuff going on now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's, what's going on here? Okay, so maybe not new stuff, just faster... Oh, faster stuff. Okay, got the dodge in. Yeah, they have. Okay. However, here's the nice thing about these guys. Unless I eat crow on this. These guys should drop health when they get killed. Dang it. Alright. It's not going to matter if I'm already dead. Do that. There's there's some health, and we got a legendary weapon that dropped. Okay, let's see what it is. Uh, crasher shotgun. All right, you know we're gonna take that just because it's legendary, and we're gonna hope for the best. Well, it certainly knocks their ass right down to the ground. I like that. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where did I go? He landed on me. All right. For fighting him, I'm going to go back to the freezer rifle, though. We got to make some serious progress here now. Hope to not find out what that is. That looks like maybe a one-hit kill type thing. Oh boy, there goes the beam. Let's go with that. I like the invulnerability that you get. When you're, uh, whoa, 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 let's stay away from him when he's doing that nonsense. Now, as you can see here, some of these boss fights, you know, they can they can go on for a while. Now, I like that. Um, I know, I, I get it that not everybody does. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, the best thing you can do, if you can find it during a run, there's uh, relics out there. Boy, we almost got full health back. Heck, heck we do. Um, there's relics out there that will um, give you a higher percentage of uh, damage done to bosses. And again, if you haven't seen the last run, it was epic, by the way. Um, come on, buddy, you're almost down. I had a bunch of those, and they were extremely effective. Outstanding. All right. What do we got here? Crasher shotgun. You know what? I think we're going to stick with what we got. Let's see what kind of upgrade options we've got here. Immunity against burn. 30% max HP. Hmm. I kind of like that, because we've got uh, a number of areas to go still. Um, why don't we do this one? Immunity against burn. I think that might be nice as a defensive. Let's do that. And 
We still technically have enough for another one. Let's see what's in here. 50% all attack power increase. Defense fixed at zero. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Weak spot detector. Oh, that would have been good. Generates a shield equivalent to 15% of max HP for five seconds. Now, the weapon's always in use. That's why I say no to those. All right, we're moving on here. We are moving on. Starting planet okay. exploration. Oh, do we have... We don't have another boss fight, do we? Alien nest discovered. Oh, I think we've got another boss fight. What, what is this? Shock immunity. Immunity against shock effects. I don't know. Let's do it, just in case. So we got burn and shock immunity. Increased damage to burn targets. Skill power increased by 50%. On use, gang immunity to all status effects. 200% increased defense, 50% for 15 seconds. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We just gotta remember to use it. Holy smokes. Okay, well, that's that's a good way to get rid of them. Annihilate the alien nest, okay. Will do. I'm, I'm waiting to get attacked. Is this, uh, is this how this is supposed to be? Let's uh, bust down another bunch of them. Okay, all right, now it's, now it's gonna get tough, I bet. Knocked his ass down right before he was going to attack. That worked quite well. This nest just doesn't want to go down. There it is. We got a legendary over there that just dropped. Let's see what we got here. Plumber shotgun. I like it. Let's do it. We did really well with this gun um, in that last run that I keep bringing up. Reason being is that not only is it really powerful, uh, but it also... Uh, stuns the enemy that it hits. I mean, it's really good. I'm surprised we're not getting attacked. I, I think um, I think something may be wrong with this area we're playing through. I feel like uh, enemies should be hopping out of these. I mean, hey, I'm not going to complain at all. I'll, I'll take the free points. Speaking of, we've got 522. Increased duration of status effects on enemy targets. Oh, that might be nice with this shotgun now. Uh, we're going to do that. 15% incoming melee damage reduction. Let's see what the other ones have. Immunity against, yeah, we got that. Recover 20% HP at the beginning of each stage. Eh, 100% defense increase. Recover 1% of max HP every second. Oh, I like that. Let's do that. And let's see what's in here. Ignore 40% of enemy's defense. 50% weapon power increase. 30% attack speed decrease. That's so a help me, hurt me. Uh, we're going to go with this. Or that defense, and I think uh, we're ready to rock here. All right, so that was an interesting round. Okay, 
Starting planet exploration. Yes. What do we got here? Another another boss, maybe? You know, usually if you see this doohickey, it means you're, you know, you're coming into a boss situation, usually. Um, all right, increase weapon power by 50% for 10 seconds when used. Increase skill radius by two times. I think we'll go with this. We'll buff this again. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh. Well. Nice to see you again, sir. Well, let's see if he's going to be different at all. Uh, this was the final boss of, of the previous run. Oh, boy. That's not great. That's not great. Give him hell, don't worry. Oof. Watch out for that tail whip. Ah, dang. Nice. Okay. Get used to uh, dodging that tail whip. And using that as soon as it's available every time because we get a buff off of it. Alright, well, first health bar is going down at a good clip. I guess the challenge with meeting bosses this early on, and this many of them, is that you don't have a, a full slate of upgrades like you do when you're going up against the final one all the way at the end. Alright, good. Oh, wow. Uh-oh, I think he got me that time. Oof. Took all that one. Let's get out of there. Swigs. I think all those guys got killed for the most part. Uh-oh. I don't know how I managed to dodge that. Let's get out of there. Weeks. Well, some of my uh, health regen should kick in here. So at least there's that. This guy might drop health as well. He goes down. Oh, he did. All right. Oh! What kind of gun is this? Striker shotgun. Let's try it, maybe. Oh, dang it. Oh, it's not looking good. It is not looking good. Oof. Man, that area is not messing around. That is for sure. Symphonia, it's a tough one. All right, let's see how we did in terms of uh, resource collection here. We might have enough to... Uh, well, maybe not. I was going to say we might have enough to grab a pet, but I think we've got to hit level 15 to get that last set of uh, crons. That's the blue currency. What do we have here? I think we started with 1,800. I think we're going to end with 1,800. Yeah, but we did end up getting a... Uh, 
uh, season point, a vault point. Um, that's these little guys up in the upper right corner. So, um, what do we want to do here? Cooldown for survival skill reduced by 6%. I think we're gonna, oops. We're gonna, we're gonna hit the right button. That's what Accessing we're gonna try to do. System. I think we're gonna pop it in there. That'll be helpful. There it is. All right. So now it's now it's reduced by six percent. Hey, little by little, you know that's uh, that's what you do with these rogue light games. Um, Accessing toy worker system. I don't know what I'm gonna pick up. So the weapon upgrade, skill upgrade, turbo boost, five percent survival skill decrease. Acquire fifty resource units on start or acquire 20 resource units for every additional planet expedition. Huh. I don't know, you know, I'll probably go with uh, the weapon power upgrade. That's what I'm thinking. And then I think these guys uh, attack for you as well. So we'll probably go with the gun hound. Anyway, I hope you uh, enjoyed seeing a little bit more of this game. I'm gonna keep playing it. Uh, you know, the, the videos seem to catch interest on the channel and uh, as long as people are interested in you know watching uh the games that i'm playing i'll, I'll keep playing them and uh yeah, i would love to hear from you in the comments if you're planning on playing this one if you have played it what you think of it all that good stuff and uh who knows you know maybe i'll uh, see you on the battlefield at some point i'm gonna give the multiplayer function a try and uh i don't know it'll probably be a blast all right, well, you take care. Have a good rest of your day, and we'll see you next time on the Goat Force Gaming Channel. Bye-bye.